What's up, guys? How y'all doing today? I apologize that I look disheveled, and that's because I just got out of bed not too long ago. So you're getting bedhead Austin for today. Today, everybody, the first official trailer for Francis Ford Coppola's new film, Megalopolis, has been released. Now, I'm a person that is intrigued by this movie because Francis Ford Coppola has made some of the greatest films of all time. There's no question, like films such as, I don't know, The Godfather, which was my favorite mobster film of all time, Apocalypse Now, Bram Stoker's Dracula, but he has, you know, made some misses like any other great filmmaker has in their career. This is a movie that I've kept my eyes on for really a while now, especially knowing that Francis Ford Coppola financed, as far as I'm aware, the whole thing by himself. From what I know, he put up $100 million of his own money, plus $20 million more as part of a contingency plan, as far as I'm aware. And for those of you who know, the number one, well, really one of the biggest rules in Hollywood, and that is that you'd never finance your own film. And the fact that Francis Ford Coppola literally financed his own movie, I mean, I'm very curious to see where that $100 million went to, and plus the cash of this thing is huge, all behind-the-scenes stuff that I've been hearing about. So knowing this movie is actually getting released is insane. And, you know, as a person that is a fan of Francis Ford Coppola and is curious to see what this epic vision of his that he's been wanting to do for a long time, you, come on. You can't deny that you're at least a wee bit interested in this movie. Before I continue on with today's video, I just wanted to say... Welcome to my channel, everybody. For those of you who are coming by my channel for the very first time, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you do not miss a future video or a future review, reaction, at top five, or whatever I have coming your way, and join me on my journey to 10k subscribers and beyond. Because believe me when I say this, guys, you are not going to want to miss the cool shit I have coming your way. And for those of you who are coming back to my channel, Welcome back, guys. You have no idea how happy I'm to see your faces once again. With that bit out of the way, it is time to do my reaction to watch the trailer together for the latest film by Francis Ford Coppola, Megalopolis. Here we go, guys. Have the trailer loaded up. And in three, two, one, here we go. Don't let the now destroy the forever. True genius is often misunderstood. Hmm. Uh, okay, so I see what they're doing here. Sorry if you heard that. Okay, who said that? Bram Stoker. What? What the fuck? One filmmaker has always been ahead of his time. Go. Now. From visionary writer and director Francis Ford Coppola comes an event nothing can prepare you for. Whoa. Imagine today's society as a branch of civilization. About to reach a dead end. Is this way we're living the only one that's available to us? My plan is a city that people can dream about. Megalopolis. What about those standing in your way? Power the people! Who like it the way it is? People don't need dreams. People need help now. Cool looking movie. Destroy the forever. We're in need of a great debate about the future. Holy shit, that one visual. Enjoy the show. One, two, three. Yippee. Yay. Great cast. Dustin Hoffman? Wow. <laughs> There's still so much to accomplish, but is there time? Wait. 
Go. Francis Ford Coppola's Megalopolis. There's only one real word that comes to mind as that trailer ends. Huh. There's a lot of words going through my head right now, but uh, the main reaction or the main expression that I have right now is, huh. I will say this right off the bat. Visually wise, this movie looks incredible. Like, stunning. The VFX look really, really cool, although there are some shots that, while they look great, um, there's some that don't look the greatest, but out as a conceptual thing, it looks really, really cool. And again, the cast looks, I mean, it's a big movie. It's epic. It's very, very ambitious because it feels like that this movie is trying to tell a huge story. I mean, a huge story. And by the way, I liked the fact, I mean, this is probably just me and a, and a thing I liked about the trailer. I liked the fact that they decided to show little clips or little uh, quotes, blurbs of reviewers of Francis Ford Coppola's other films, Godfather, Apocalypse Now, and Bram Stoker's Dracula, my favorite films of his, and saying, hey, these are the films that were divisive when they first came out, which is mind-blowing to even think that The Godfather was a divisive film because it's one of my favorite films, period. This movie looks like it's either going to be one of two things when it comes out. Either a beautiful-looking movie that's also going to be an absolute clusterfuck of a narrative because it feels like a movie that really needs to have a heavy focus in its narrative, or B, it's going to be one of those movies that's going to be praised as one of those films that's made, I mean, as it said in the trailer, by a visionary filmmaker. I'm hoping it's the, the latter because, I mean, again, visually-wise, the film looks really, really cool, and you can totally see what Francis Ford Coppola is trying to do in this movie, but otherwise, it feels like it could also come off as an absolute mess. Some people have been saying that A, that it is his masterpiece, and B, some people have been saying that it's like, what the hell did I just watch? Now, for me personally, as y'all can imagine, I'm hoping that it is hopefully going to be not only a huge surprise, but hopefully one of the best films there, and if not, oh boy, $100 million. Yeah, that is going to wrap it up for my reaction to the official trailer for Francis Ford Coppola's Megalopolis. I hope you enjoyed the reaction. If so, hit the like button, or if you disliked my reaction, hit the dislike button. If you guys want to see my previous two trailer reactions, please click on the right there or right there. And of course, until my next review or video goes live, I'll see you all next time.